Today's video is my cozy night in routine, but it's the getting festive edition because Christmas is right around the corner. On this particular day, I had a little workout session in the evening, so here I am coming home from the gym, all nice and smelly, love it. The first thing I do when I get home, obviously besides take off my coat, is get into my pajamas. And today's pajamas are my Bah Humbug pajamas. Not only does the tank top say Bah Humbug, which is one of my favorite phrases of all time and I need to say it more, but it has dogs with Santa hats on it. I'm also wearing these rabbit slippers that I got on ASOS. I thought they were so cute and Reggie absolutely loves them as well, but he's not getting them. Since I just worked out, I wanted to wash my face immediately because I just wanna wash my face as soon as I leave the gym. So I'm gonna do a quick evening routine and of course I'm rocking the clip again. I'll be rocking it for the entire duration of this video. I can't relax unless my hair is up into clip. We all know that. With cold weather brings dry, flaky, unsexual lips. It's true people, it's just one of those things. So I'm using the Fresh Lip Scrub. I love this so much because first of all, it smells good enough to eat. I try not to eat it, but sometimes I slip. You know, we all slip every now and then. I just take a little bit on my finger and rub it in my lips and then rinse it off. You've seen me talk about the Omora Vitsa, is that how you say it? Thermal cleansing balm before. I'm almost done this one. I'm so sad about it because I absolutely love it. I'm gonna go on record and say it's my all time favorite cleansing balm. Big statement. Anyway, I just take a little bit and rub it into my skin. I try to do this for a few minutes and really just take a moment to get zen and really massage it into the skin. Here you can see I'm like, it smells so good. I love the smell. Next up, it's serum time. This is the one I've been using from Pi. I have an entire blog post dedicated to this, so I'll link it down below if you want to read more about it, but I have been loving it. I think it is one of the best serums I've ever tried, especially if you've got angry skin like I usually do. Night cream, I'm using the Estelle and Tilled Night Cream. This is a rose night cream, it's really nice. It's not too heavy, but it's really hydrating. And rose really agrees with my skin. It's always so calming and nice. And ooh, I'm putting myself to sleep just thinking about it. Of course, lip balm, I'm using the Ilia Lip Balm. It's just a regular kind of chapstick sort of thing, and it's really good, I like it a lot. There would be no cozy night in routine without me making a cup of tea. So I tried this one and I spilled it everywhere as per freaking normal. You know what, let's just ignore that. I just put a little bit into my favorite teacup and pour the hot water in and that is how you make tea. I just let it steep for a little bit. And now the festive part. We are going to be wrapping some gifts and as you can see, I'm getting exotic up in here. I saw this wrapping paper, it's from House of Fraser, and I think it's so fun to experiment with wrapping paper. It's obviously not the traditional Christmassy kind of wrapping paper, but that's what I love about it. I think it is so cool, and it's really gonna stand out underneath my tree. I'm certainly not a professional wrapper, but I actually enjoy wrapping gifts so much. Unfortunately, I haven't done too much Christmas shopping yet. I'm always one of those last minute shoppers, but every single year it's the same thing. It's like Christmas Eve and I have no gifts for anybody, but I'm trying. Mom, don't worry. I do have a gift for you though. I wish I could tell you what was inside this gift. It's actually for my grandpa. I might show it in my Christmas gift guide video. Luckily, my grandpa doesn't watch my YouTube videos. Sad truth of life. It's true, he doesn't. You're probably thinking, what am I doing beside my cactus? Well, this is actually gonna be my Christmas cactus, okay people? See the vision, see the vision. So I'm actually not spending Christmas in London this year. I always go home for Christmas to Canada. So I'm so impressed with the growth of this cactus. It had to be showcased. This bauble is also from House of Fraser. I really liked it, but I thought I can't put too many baubles on my cactus. So I'm thinking, how can I do this? And I devised a plan just to put it on top. And you know what? It's the perfect statement bauble. So plug those lights in and voila, there it is. My beautiful Christmas cactus. I am in love with this so much. When Aslan got home and saw it, I think he shed a tear because he was just so excited to see it. It's our first Christmas cactus. All that's left to do is put your gifts underneath the tree. I need a few more gifts. It's looking a little bit bare, not gonna lie. But like I said, I'm a little bit behind on that, okay? Let's not forget about Reggie. We really need to get him into the festive mood, so I'm putting on his Santa hat. Of course, he isn't the biggest fan of his Santa hat. As you can see, he's trying to destroy it, but I simply told him that it's a very important part of getting festive for a cozy night in and he agreed to let me put it on him, and it's so cute. He really does not like that ball on the top of the hat. As you can see, he is not a happy camper, but he looks so cute in it. I can't help it, but 
you know, I'm not gonna force him to wear something he doesn't want to. He can make up his own mind about it. Of course, I had to hang up our stockings. Stockings are my favorite part about Christmas. And I did also get some mistletoe because I just want love. So I'm gonna run around and try to get somebody to kiss me. Anybody? Any takers? No? Reggie? Come on. Can we all take a moment to appreciate Reggie's overbite? Like those front teeth make me want to cry of happiness, but he wasn't really into the kissing. I don't think he understands mistletoe, but he was very interested in the mistletoe and by that I mean he wanted to eat it, but eventually I stole a kiss from him. So the only thing left to do is get nice and cozied up with my book, have my tea, probably put on a little movie or something or watch Suits, my new favorite show. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed watching my cozy festive night in routine and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Hey everyone, today's video is going to be my November favorites. I have a lot of things to talk about and not that much time. I mean, we could be here all day if you really wanted to be, but I don't think you want me to do that because you know I could talk for a long time like I'm doing right now. I'm gonna get